Ann Feldman from the TT for T team, and today I'm going to talk to you about TweetDeck. What is TweetDeck? TweetDeck is a tool that allows you to see Twitter hashtags at a glance. It's a great way to organize Twitter into a more manageable fashion. This is especially helpful if you're joining a chat. What's wonderful is you can go to TweetDeck.com on the web and then you can sign in on the web and use TweetDeck. So go to TweetDeck.Twitter.com and then you just sign in with your Twitter credentials. Now since I've already been here, mine will automatically sign in and load up. Now what you see here are columns of tweets. So each one of these columns are going to fall in with tweets as the page loads. So you can see this is my home feed, so everyone I follow, their tweets will fall in here. These are hashtags I follow, so TT for T is Tech Tools for Teaching, and this is our hashtag, so when people tweet to TT for T, these are the tweets that come up. Over here is the GAF chat, so for Google Apps for Education. And here's BPSNE for Bellevue Public Schools. And as I move across here, here's my MOOC I'm in on coaching digital literacy, and here's a hashtag for it. Notifications are people who have specifically at mentioned me. They'll show up here. And then as I go across, then there's Ed Chat, and so on. You can go on and on by adding as many of these as you'd like. Now, the way you add a column is you come down here to where it has the plus. It says plus add column. So when someone says follow this hashtag, you can go down here to plus and add a column. Then come up here to search. And this is where you put in the hashtag that you'd like to take a look at. So whether that's maybe first grade chat or a chemistry chat, a math chat, makerspace, digital citizen ch chat, PBL, whatever you'd like to put in here. So let's just type in EdTech. So I'm going to look for EdTech and press enter. And now what falls in is anything that has the hashtag EdTech is going to fall into this column. So you can kind of do a little preview here and then if you decide you want to add it, click on add column. Now that will be added to the very end of all the columns that you have. So now here's EdChat and these are all the tweets that are falling in for EdChat. Now if you want to move that, you can click on this little symbol here with these circles and lines, and that gives you some choices. You can come down here and you can use these arrows to move this column left or right. You can also share out a whole column, clear a column, remove the column. Sometimes that needs to happen too. If you click on those little circles with lines, you can close it back up. You can also come over here and grab that little arrow, the four-headed arrow here, and then you can drag these columns across as well. So two ways to move your columns and get yourself organized here in TweetDeck. So what's really nice is you can have, like perhaps you're involved in a couple of different chats at night, you can have those columns side by side so you can be reading a lot of information at the same time. So very helpful. Another helpful feature is to tweet out a tweet deck. You just push the blue tweet button. And from here, you can go ahead and say what's happening just like you would at twitter.com. One feature of tweet deck I find extremely helpful is the schedule tweet button. So let's say you're up and you find a great resource and it's late at night. You tweet that out, not very many people will see it. But what you can do is you can go ahead and type your tweet in here and then down here you can schedule that tweet. So if you click on this button, you can decide what time you'd like that tweet to be scheduled. So for example, I can say excited to help at Terry Brown with her at Kahoot project. 
and I can come down here and schedule that tweet to be delivered on Monday at 9 o'clock a.m. And now I'm going to go ahead and say tweet at that specific time and now look over here I have a scheduled column that will appear and it says that this is the tweet I have scheduled for Monday at 9 o'clock and I will be with that teacher at 9 o'clock on Monday so that will be fun that tweet will just fire off at 9 o'clock Monday you can always come in here and just click edit or delete if you need to make a change so that's a little bit about the basics of TweetDeck but the main idea of TweetDeck is being able to have multiple columns up at once so that you can really see a lot of things happening at one time. And that doesn't happen when you're on just the plain Twitter.com website. TweetDeck is definitely a must when you participate in a chat. It makes things so much easier. So there you have it. A few tips about how to use TweetDeck.Twitter.com to organize all those tweets. Thanks for watching. TT for tea.